Some serious questions tonight raised by a shocking photo of celebrity chef Nigella Lawson with her billionaire husband's hand wrapped around her throat. It all played out in public in a restaurant packed with other diners. So should one of them have stepped in? When should you stop what looks like abuse? ABC's David Wright takes a look at the social science and common sense. Even if she were not a beloved celebrity chef, it's a shocking image. Nigella Lawson with her husband's hand at her throat during a fight at a London restaurant. After a British tabloid published several photos, Charles Saatchi insisted it's not what it seems. There was no grip, he said, calling the couple's dispute a playful tiff and saying she was crying because she hates fighting. Other witnesses didn't see it that way. One diner quoted saying, it was utterly shocking to watch. I have no doubt she was scared. One big question people are asking today, should those witnesses have stepped in? ABC's popular show, What Would You Do?, ran an experiment with an actress made up to look battered and bruised. Her boyfriend berating her at a restaurant. Even people who did flag the manager were fearful of getting involved. Some of them said they were frightened the abuser would turn on them. For all I know, it could be crazy. You could pick up the knife next to him and, you know, do something with it. Others said they worried intervening would be counterproductive. I just figured it the way he was, if I stepped in, he would have just taken it out on her. Do those sound like universal reactions? Absolutely. People don't like conflict. Dr. Leslie Sapini is a marriage and family therapist who specializes in crisis intervention. If you saw something like this at a restaurant, what would you do? I would go over and say stop. You really need to address the abuser. So you, you go to the abuser and with a sort of harsh tone so that they know that you're in charge, you're in command now, and you say stop. An astonishing one in four women are victims of domestic violence. For her part, Nigella Lawson isn't saying she's one of them. She's left town. Tonight, British police are investigating whether there may be sufficient evidence to charge her husband with assault. David Wright, ABC News, Los Angeles.